Do you want to know what exactly mobile data management is? Firstly, let us talk about data management. Data management generally is a field of computer science which deals with all aspects for the efficient management of data. It deals with from storing data effectively on magnetic disks up to providing structures for the efficient retrieval of data. It also handles concurrency with data as accessed by many concurrent processes. What's data management offering? It offers mechanism for recovery in cases of failures and for optimizing the execution of queries. On the other hand, another field of computer science is mobile computing that deals with mobility, some aspects of its hardware and software as well as its communication stack. So, mobile data management lies at the intersection of these two fields. It particularly attempts to study data which is generated in a mobile environment. Understanding the importance of this field is crucial at first to realize how mobility impacts in our everyday life. Constantly, we all carry along with our smartphones or cell phones which provide different sensing capabilities. Introduce powerful processes and more importantly provide access to a large ecosystem of software applications. Some particular challenges in this spectrum are Big data Since mobile devices feature many sensors and then sensors generate lots of data ceaselessly, it is logical that existing infrastructures are not able to adequately process and analyze data in a timely manner. So the challenge is to develop distributed and parallel algorithm that will analyze data in time. Second challenge is privacy. Since mobile devices are carried around by real users, this means that some services might be able to know about your current location. In order to cope with this challenge, it has to be developed techniques and algorithms which provide new utility and allow you to control your personal information. Crowdsourcing is the third challenge. Computers are very capable to storing and processing data. However, they face difficulties to do arbitrary things. That's why computers outsource the difficult tasks to humans, who can provide access to a missing piece of knowledge. Last but not least, it relates to energy conservation. Mobile device has limited energy source so energy conscious algorithms are needed so that applications work functionally. The research center of the University of Cyprus, specifically the laboratory of Mr. Demetris Sinalifa was funded by Microsoft and Nokia in Finland. To develop an innovative application which realizes the KNN algorithm. The general idea was to develop a social network where people will be able to interact with the closest people around them. For instance if a person is in need. He can publish the problem and instantly receive help and advice from the nearest users. Raise it is an innovative messaging app delivers your questions and thoughts to the closest users around you, regardless of who they are. There's no sign up required and you stay anonymous, so it's just about the experience of sharing, by text, audio, video or photos. The difference from other existing social networks is that you communicate with people that you don't know. Due to this fact, application has to compute a KNN query in a really skillful way for millions of users every few seconds. By far, system has been used by many users worldwide. Created using Powtoon.